Life is a journey filled with ups and downs, where finding motivation and inspiration becomes essential. For those who have faith in Jesus Christ and God, this quest is deeply rooted in their spiritual beliefs. Together, motivated by faith in Jesus and God, these forces create a fulfilling life, guiding us through life's twists and turns, leading us towards self-discovery and growth. In the video ahead, we'll explore how faith-based motivation and inspiration can be cultivated, from discovering purpose to nurturing resilience. Join us on this faith-filled journey, as we unlock the secrets to a life filled with motivation and inspiration, all under the loving guidance of Jesus and God. With faith as our compass, we embark on a transformative quest, making dreams a reality under their loving care. Romans 5 verses 3 to 4 Not only so, but we also glory in our sufferings, because we know that suffering produces perseverance. Perseverance, character, and character, hope. Galatians 6 verse 9 let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we will reap a harvest if we do not give up. James 1 verses 3 to 4 Because you know that the testing of your faith produces perseverance. Let perseverance finish its work so that you may be mature and complete, not lacking anything. Ephesians 4 verse 2 be completely humble and gentle. Be patient, bearing with one another in love. Psalm 27 verse 14 Wait for the Lord. Be strong and take heart and wait for the Lord. Proverbs 14 verse 29 Whoever is patient has great understanding, but one who is quick-tempered displays folly. Colossians 3 verse 12 Therefore, as God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. 2 Peter 3 verse 9 The Lord is not slow in keeping his promise, as some understand slowness. Instead, he is patient with you not wanting anyone to perish, but everyone to come to repentance. Romans 12 verse 12 Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction, faithful in prayer. Proverbs 15 verse 18 A hot-tempered person stirs up conflict, but the one who is patient calms a quarrel. Psalm 37 verse 7 be still before the Lord and wait patiently for him. Do not fret when people succeed in their ways when they carry out their wicked schemes. 1 Corinthians 13 verse 4 Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. Psalm 40 verse 1 I waited patiently for the Lord. He turned to me and heard my cry. Proverbs 16 verse 32 Better a patient person than a warrior, one with self-control than one who takes a city. Hebrews 10 verse 36 You need to persevere so that when you have done the will of God, you will receive what he has promised. Psalm 130 verse 5 I wait for the Lord, my whole being waits, and in his word I put my hope. 1 Thessalonians 5 verse 14 And we urge you, brothers and sisters, warn those who are idle and disruptive, encourage the disheartened, help the weak, be patient with everyone. Psalm 37 verse 34 Hope in the Lord and keep his way. He will exalt you to inherit the land. When the wicked are destroyed, you will see it. Ecclesiastes 7 verse 8 The end of a matter is better than its beginning, and patience is better than pride. Psalm 62 verse 5 Yes, my soul, find rest in God. 
My hope comes from him. Proverbs 25 verse 15 Through patience, a ruler can be persuaded, and a gentle tongue can break a bone. Psalm 37 verse 9 For those who are evil will be destroyed, but those who hope in the Lord will inherit the land. Luke 8 verse 15 But the seed on good soil stands for those with a noble and good heart, who hear the word, retain it, and by persevering produce a crop. 1 Corinthians 13 verse 7 It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Proverbs 19 verse 11 a person's wisdom yields patience. It is to one's glory to overlook an offense. Psalm 25 verse 5 Guide me in your truth and teach me, for you are God my Savior, and my hope is in you all day long. Hebrews 6 verse 12 We do not want you to become lazy, but to imitate those who through faith and patience inherit what has been promised. Romans 15 verse 5 May the God who gives endurance and encouragement give you the same attitude of mind toward each other that Christ Jesus had. Psalm 33 verse 20 We wait in hope for the Lord. He is our help and our shield. Romans 8 verse 25 But if we hope for what we do not yet have, we wait for it patiently. Proverbs 21 verse 5 The plans of the diligent lead to profit as surely as haste leads to poverty. Psalm 31 verse 24 Be strong and take heart, all you who hope in the Lord. Romans 2 verse 7 to those who by persistence in doing good seek glory, honor, and immortality, he will give eternal life. Psalm 119 verse 49 Remember your word to your servant, for you have given me hope. James 5 verses 7 to 8 Be patient, then, brothers and sisters, until the Lord's coming. See how the farmer waits for the land to yield its valuable crop, patiently waiting for the autumn and spring rains. You too, be patient and stand firm, because the Lord's coming is near. Psalm 33 verse 18 But the eyes of the Lord are on those who fear him, on those whose hope is in his unfailing love. Romans 15 verse 13 May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him, so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. 2 Corinthians 6 verse 6 Impurity, understanding, patience, and kindness, in the Holy Spirit and in sincere love. Psalm 147 verse 11 the Lord delights in those who fear him, who put their hope in his unfailing love. 1 Timothy 1 verse 16 But for that very reason, I was shown mercy so that in me, the worst of sinners, Christ Jesus might display his immense patience as an example for those who would believe in him and receive eternal life. Psalm 130 verse 6 my soul waits for the Lord more than watchmen wait for the morning, more than watchmen wait for the morning. Romans 12 verse 11 Never be lacking in zeal, but keep your spiritual fervor, serving the Lord. Isaiah 40 verse 31 But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles, they will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. 2 Corinthians 12 verse 12 The things that mark an apostle's signs, wonders, and miracles were done among you with great perseverance. 
Psalm 130 verse 7. Israel, put your hope in the Lord, for with the Lord is unfailing love and with him is full redemption. 1 Corinthians 13 verse 13. And now these three remain faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. Psalm 71 verse 14. As for me, I will always have hope. I will praise you more and more. Hebrews 12 verses 1 to 2. Therefore, since we are surrounded by such a great cloud of witnesses, let us throw off everything that hinders and the sin that so easily entangles. And let us run with perseverance the race marked out for us, fixing our eyes on Jesus, the pioneer and perfecter of faith. For the joy set before him, he endured the cross, scorning its shame, and sat down at the right hand of the throne of God. Psalm 62 verses 1 to 2 Truly my soul finds rest in God. My salvation comes from him. Truly he is my rock and my salvation. He is my fortress. I will never be shaken. Titus 2 verse 2 Teach the older men to be temperate, worthy of respect, self-controlled, and sound in faith, in love, and in endurance. Proverbs 14 verse 17 A quick-tempered person does foolish things, and the one who devises evil schemes is hated. Psalm 31 verse 14 But I trust in you, Lord, I say, you are my God. Romans 2 verse 4 Or do you show contempt for the riches of his kindness, forbearance, and patience, not realizing that God's kindness is intended to lead you to repentance? Psalm 33 verse 22 May your unfailing love be with us, Lord, even as we put our hope in you. Hebrews 10 verse 35 So do not throw away your confidence. It will be richly rewarded. 2 Corinthians 6 verse 4 Rather, as servants of God, we commend ourselves in every way in great endurance, in troubles, hardships, and distresses. Psalm 33 verse 4 For the word of the Lord is right and true. He is faithful in all he does. Hebrews 6 verse 15 And so, after waiting patiently, Abraham received what was promised. Psalm 52 verse 9 For what you have done, I will always praise you in the presence of your faithful people. And I will hope in your name, for your name is good. Romans 8 verses 24 to 25 For in this hope we were saved. But hope that is seen is no hope at all. Who hopes for what they already have? But if we hope for what we do not yet have, we wait for it patiently. Proverbs 19 verse 2 Desire without knowledge is not good. How much more will hasty feet miss the way? Psalm 71 verse 5 For you have been my hope, sovereign Lord, my confidence since my youth. 2 Corinthians 1 verse 6 If we are distressed, it is for your comfort and salvation. If we are comforted, it is for your comfort which produces in you patient endurance of the same sufferings we suffer. Psalm 119 verse 81 My soul faints with longing for your salvation, but I have put my hope in your word. Hebrews 11 verse 13 All these people were still living by faith when they died. They did not receive the things promised. They only saw them and welcomed them from a distance, admitting that they were foreigners and strangers on earth. 2 Corinthians 4 verse 16 
Therefore, we do not lose heart. Though outwardly we are wasting away, yet inwardly we are being renewed day by day. Romans 15 verse 4 For everything that was written in the past was written to teach us, so that through the endurance taught in the scriptures and the encouragement they provide we might have hope. Psalm 42 verse 11 Why, my soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my Savior and my God. Romans 8 verse 26 In the same way, the Spirit helps us in our weakness. We do not know what we ought to pray for, but the Spirit himself intercedes for us through wordless groans. 2 Corinthians 13 verse 11 Finally, brothers and sisters, rejoice. Strive for full restoration. Encourage one another. Be of one mind. Live in peace. And the God of love and peace will be with you. Psalm 43 verse 5 Why, my soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my Savior and my God. 2 Timothy 3 verse 10 You, however, know all about my teaching, my way of life, my purpose, faith, patience, love, endurance. Psalm 62 verses 5 to 6 Yes, my soul, find rest in God. My hope comes from him. Truly he is my rock and my salvation. He is my fortress. I will not be shaken. Titus 2 verses 11 to 12 For the grace of God has appeared that offers salvation to all people. It teaches us to say no to ungodliness and worldly passions and to live self-controlled, upright, and godly lives in this present age. 2 Timothy 4 verse 2 Preach the word. Be prepared in season and out of season. Correct. Rebuke and encourage with great patience and careful instruction. Psalm 119 verse 114 You are my refuge and my shield. I have put my hope in your word. 1 Peter 1 verse 21 through him you believe in God, who raised him from the dead and glorified him, and so your faith and hope are in God. Psalm 9 verse 18 But God will never forget the needy. The hope of the afflicted will never perish. 1 Timothy 6 verse 11 But you, man of God, flee from all this and pursue righteousness godliness, faith, love, endurance, and gentleness. Psalm 39 verse 7 But now, Lord, what do I look for? My hope is in you. 2 Peter 1 verses 5 to 6 For this very reason, make every effort to add to your faith goodness, and to goodness, knowledge, and to knowledge, self-control, and to self-control, perseverance, and to perseverance, godliness. Psalm 130 verses 3 to 4 If you, Lord, kept a record of sins, Lord, who could stand? But with you there is forgiveness, so that we can, with reverence, serve you. 1 Timothy 6 verse 12 Fight the good fight of the faith. Take hold of the eternal life to which you were called when you made your good confession in the presence of many witnesses. Psalm 39 verse 8 Deliver me from all my transgressions. Do not make me the scorn of fools. Hebrews 10 verse 23 Let us hold unswervingly to the hope we profess, for he who promised is faithful. 
Psalm 40 verses 1 to 3. I waited patiently for the Lord. He turned to me and heard my cry. He lifted me out of the slimy pit, out of the mud and mire. He set my feet on a rock and gave me a firm place to stand. He put a new song in my mouth, a hymn of praise to our God. Many will see and fear the Lord and put their trust in him. 2 Timothy 2 verse 10 Therefore I endure everything for the sake of the elect, that they too may obtain the salvation that is in Christ Jesus, with eternal glory. Psalm 71 verse 20 Though you have made me see troubles, many and bitter, you will restore my life again. From the depths of the earth, you will again bring me up. Hebrews 6 verses 18 to 19. God did this so that, by two unchangeable things in which it is impossible for God to lie, we who have fled to take hold of the hope set before us may be greatly encouraged. We have this hope as an anchor for the soul, firm and secure. It enters the inner sanctuary behind the curtain. James 5 verses 10 to 11 Brothers and sisters, as an example of patience in the face of suffering, take the prophets who spoke in the name of the Lord. As you know, we count as blessed those who have persevered. You have heard of Job's perseverance and have seen what the Lord finally brought about. The Lord is full of compassion and mercy. Hebrews 12 verse 7 Endure hardship as discipline. God is treating you as his children. For what children are not disciplined by their father? 2 Timothy 4 verse 5 but you, keep your head in all situations, endure hardship, do the work of an evangelist, discharge all the duties of your ministry. Psalm 71 verse 21 You will increase my honor and comfort me once more. 2 Corinthians 1 verses 3 to 4 Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ the Father of compassion and the God of all comfort, who comforts us in all our troubles, so that we can comfort those in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves receive from God. Psalm 39 verse 12 Hear my prayer, Lord, listen to my cry for help. Do not be deaf to my weeping. I dwell with you as a foreigner, a stranger, as all my ancestors were. James 1 verse 19 My dear brothers and sisters, take note of this. Everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. Romans 8 verse 18 I consider that our present sufferings are not worth comparing with the glory that will be revealed in us. Psalm 40 verse 11 Do not withhold your mercy from me, Lord. May your love and faithfulness always protect me. James 5 verse 8 You too, be patient and stand firm, because the Lord's coming is near. Psalm 130 verse 8 He himself will redeem Israel from all their sins, 